And to improve its capacity in tackling insecurity in the country, the Nigeria police have trained 192 officers as experts in explosive ordnance disposal, chemical, biological, radiological, nuclear operations. The officers graduated from the police training school in Ender Hills in Nassau State. Godwin Agua reports. Officers of the Explosive Ordnance Disposal, Chemical, Biological, Radiological, Nuclear Command displayed their tactical prowess at the police school in Nassau State. The command is saddled with the responsibility of performing improvised device disposal, unexploded ordnance clearance, and demolition operations. It has continued to lose most of its experienced staff to retirements, promotions, demobilization, accidents, and sicknesses. It is to fill this gap and reject the command with efficient and effective officers that the Inspector General of Police approved the deployment and training of police personnel into the command. The 19th set of the EOD officers from the 36 states of the Federation have undergone a rigorous one month training and are ready for graduation. Training curriculum was well packaged to improve, revigorate EOD CBRN operations across the country and bring out the best future EOD CBRN technicians and investigators who will be ready to confront the present increasing threats. May I advise the trainees to endeavor to develop their capacity on what they have learned, what have they been taught in line with international best practices, aim at meeting the trend and dynamics of criminality in the country. Officers are grateful for the privilege to serve in the command and are sure of their commitment to deliver on the job. Training was majorly practical exposed us to the methodology and techniques in performance of our duties as EOD CBRN agents. This was made possible by the visionary leadership, our IGP, Ali Kali Usman Baba. The 192 trained officers will be returning to the EOD units of their various commands across the country and expected to boost the existing security structures in order to curb emerging threats. Godwin, Agwam, TBC News, and the Hughes, Nazaregon.